The content list does a lot more than simply list the contents in your slide. It assigns your images to the layers in the layers list and to place markers in slide styles. It also gives you the ability to switch those images without affecting the layers attributes. Here's a basic example. In this slide, there are two images that have been resized, repositioned, and rotated. Now let's say that we want to swap the images, but keep all of the attribute changes that were made. In the content list, you can see the layer number that each of the images are assigned to. The baseball player is assigned to layer one, and the skateboarder is assigned to layer two. To rearrange the order, use the up and down arrows, or drag and drop. This is different from rearranging layers in the layers list, which is rearranging your layers in a stacking order. In other words, which layers are on top of other layers. The arrangement in the content list is also helpful when determining which images go into which place markers for slide styles that use more than one image. In this example, we have two images in a blank slide. When previewing the double deck spread dark slide style, we can see the winter image is on the bottom and the image with the boat is on the top. To swap those images before applying the slide style, simply rearrange the images in the content list, then preview the style again. This method will still work after a slide style has already been applied and in slides that have several more layers.